What's going on, everyone? It's Taylor Cowles here for CLNS Media. Today, Patriots offensive coordinator and quarterbacks coach Bill O'Brien spoke with the media. And of course, the top question on everybody's mind was who will be the starting quarterback this weekend against the Giants? Now, Bill O'Brien did say that his job isn't to make personnel decisions and that he would defer that answer to Bill Belichick. He did disclose that Mac Jones, Bailey Zappi, and Will Greer all took top offensive reps last week when the team practiced on Wednesday. However, he wouldn't disclose who the starter would be, nor who he personally recommended for the starting job, as he said that the team is more of a family environment where certain things simply don't get out. O'Brien did say, however, that whoever wins the job will be the player who performs the best in practice. Now, over the summer, that was constantly Mac Jones, and that was the only name that he really talked about. But now, with Mac Jones' turnovers, poor play, and lack of fundamentals becoming or having been a weekly problem, it's created a weird situation where the team either goes with the best player on the roster or they replace him because Mac Jones can't stop giving the ball to the other team and putting them in position to score. And frankly, teammates could just want a fresh start as Mac Jones is reportedly losing a bit of favor in the locker room. FanDuel is the exclusive wagering partner of the CLNS Media Network. Right now, new customers get $150 in bonus bets with any winning $5 Moneyline bet. FanDuel, official partner of the NFL. Now, in Mac Jones' defense, Bill O'Brien did say that he doesn't believe in the yips and that Mac Jones has played well before and that he believes he'll play well again. So that's a situation that, of course, is going to warrant close monitoring. Some other information we got from Bill O'Brien was that Bill Belichick and tight ends coach Will Lawing have been helping on the offensive line group along with assistant offensive line coach Billy Yates. Adrian Clem is still away from the team as he deals with health issues, but O'Brien did say that the coach is doing better. When O'Brien was asked about whether or not he's gonna to return to New England next season or potentially pursue a head coaching job in college next year, he said that really he needs to do a better job at the job that he's currently at and isn't focused on that right now. Now, obviously not only quarterback, but also head coach are positions where there's a lot of question marks in New England. If Bill Belichick does leave next season, the expectation is that Gerard Mayo would step up and become the team's new head coach. It would probably be best for New England if they were able to retain the defensive coaching staff while also keeping Bill O'Brien to help usher in whatever quarterback is selected in the draft as it's unlikely that Mac Jones will enter next season as the unquestioned starter. And as much change as we're probably going to see in New England over the next few months after the season ends, as much stability as they can keep with people who are doing their jobs well will be critical. Ever wish you could navigate the betting field with the confidence of a pro? Enter Odds Are. They're not a sports book, but they're the sports betting advisor you've always needed. It's like having a playbook for smarter bets right in your pocket. I've been absolutely loving the experience, and I think you will too. Especially since Patriots Press Pass listeners get a 30-day free trial. Elevate your game day and join the smart betting revolution. Go get it at oddsr.com slash press pass. That's oddsr.com slash press pass.